Hi guys, I'm Macro, and we're bringing the last hurrah for the Death Watch Army of Renown. Hey gang, with Arcs of Omen coming out pretty soon at the time we're recording this video, we thought we'd get one last shuffle in of the Death Watch Army of Renown Kill Team Strike Force. So, this is 2,000 points of Thin Black Line Space Marines. The Death Watch ability is basically we've got the Xenos Hunters chapter trait, which gives us reroll ones against a chosen battlefield roll, but the Army of Renown allows me to be able to cycle out different chapter traits, so we'll see what we pull during the game. First up in the HQ, the Warlord is a Watchmaster. They've taken the Paragon of the Chapter Warlord trait, and I've chosen the Ultramarines added to the Codex, which allows me to recycle command points on a 5+. They've also taken Xenos Bane as a second Warlord trait. This basically means in a six inch circle, they still get the Xenos Hunters chapter trait. In the second HQ slot, we've got a Chaplain with a Jump Pack and an Inferno Pistol. They've taken the Master of Sanctity upgrade. So their three litanies is Litany of Hate, Recitation of Focus, which is plus one to hit on a unit, and Catechism of Fire, which is plus one to wound in shooting against the closest unit. They've taken the Relic, the Beacon Angelus, which allows them to transport a unit to them from reserves, deep strike, or on the table. Third HQ slot is a Terminator Librarian. They've got a Force Axe. The two spells they've taken is the Armor of Contempt for a five up Feel No Pain, and Premorphic Resonance for plus one to hit, fight first, and five plus Overwatch. Now we're getting to the meat of the units. We've just got kill teams here, so it's just a troop slot apart from the Corvus Black Star later. We've got a Fortis kill team. This is five Assault Intercessors, well, Assault Bolter Intercessors, and five Assault Hellblasters. They've taken the Aquila upgrade, which gives me a reroll once against troops and something else of my choice. We've got a second Fortis kill team. This has five Stalker Bolt Rifles and five Heavy Hellblasters. They've taken the Fuhrer upgrade, which gives them reroll ones against troops and a troop focus. The first Proteus kill team is basically just decked out with plasma guns. They've got a heavy thunder hammer and they've got a black shield with a heavy thunder hammer. Otherwise, everyone else has chainswords. This unit has plasma guns, so they are anti-elite. The next Proteus kill team is exactly the same, except they've got melter guns, and so their focus is heavy. And our last kill team has the Aquila focus, so that's against troops and something of my choice. They've got a bit of a mix. We've got a melter gun, we've got a heavy thunder hammer, another heavy thunder hammer, another heavy thunder hammer. We've got three guys with Death Watch bolt guns and power swords. We've got one guy with a Death Watch combi flamer and a power sword. We've taken a Terminator with a Power Axe and a Storm Bolter, and we've got a bike to do some bike shenanigans. Last up, we've got the Corvus Black Star. It's got the Black Star Launcher, it's got twin-linked assault cannons, it's got a Hurricane Bolter, and it's got the Auspex Array, which allows it to ignore cover at the target it's firing at. All up, it's the last hurrah for what was gonna be a tournament team, so instead I get to share it with you lovely people here on the internet. G'day, my name's Jack, and today I'm bringing the Thousand Suns. Alrighty, so for today's 2000 point battle report, I'm bringing my Thousand Suns. Uh, this is Magnus' first spin out on the battlefield, so this should be, very, should be a very interesting game. He is my Warlord, naturally, in a Supreme Command Detachment. And then I follow up with the Battalion. I start with Araman. He's got Twist of Fate, Presage, and Weaver of Fate. Uh, I have an Exalted Sorcerer. I've upgraded him to have the Disc. I've given him Rahati, which allows him to cast another Psychic Power. Uh, I've given him a Waller trait, Master Misinformator, which allows me to, um, at the start of the battle round, but for the first turn, redeploy himself and D3 units. Given him the Psychic Powers, Zinch's Firestorm and Gaze of Hate. And I've given him the Relic Athenian Scrolls, which allows me to choose one of his powers. And then from that, that point onwards, I get to roll three dice for that power, drop one. For my last HQ choice, I've got an Infernal Master. His Psychic Power is Glamour of Zinch, and his two powers a uh, Glimpse of Eternity and Malefic Maelstrom. Onto the troops, five-man unit of Rubrics. Uh, psychic power for them is Kaka Demonic Curse. Then I have two identical five-man Rubric squads. Each of those have a Soul Reaper cannon and the sources have Doombolt. To finish up my troops, I've got three ten-man unit of Zangors. Last but not least, I have my elites. Now I've got a big ten-man brick of Terminators. The psychic power on the Sorcerer is Imperial Guidance and the unit is fitted out with two Soul Reapers and two Missile Racks. And my last choice for the army is a five-man unit of Terminators. They are bare bones. They literally just have all their bolters. There's no special weapons. And the Sorcerer has Doom Bolt. And that is 2,000 points on the nose. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. 
TV. Check. Cosmic Arc cartridge. Check. Power. We have power. Cosmic Arc is a game cartridge for the Atari video system. Meteor! I got it! The Cosmic Arc searches out strange creatures on distant planets. Meteor! But the deeper the arc travels in space, the tougher it gets. Then I never get back to Earth! Boys, clean your room. <sighs> We're back. Cosmic Arc by a magic. Video system must be bought separately and connected to the TV by your parents. Hi guys, I'm Maka. Welcome to Legends and Lore. This is episode two of season three of the show. Lovely to have you here. Um, this one's actually going to be the last of both Nephilim mm -hmm. and the armies of Renown. <laughs> yeah, um, that's basically going to be away in like a couple of days when we're doing this recording. So we thought we'd maybe sneak one more sneaky one in uh, just to have a bit of fun. Today in the studio, we got Jack. Hey man. Hey mate, how you doing? Good. Good to be here. So, for this 2,000 point battle report today, we've got the Thousand Suns versus the Death Watch. Um, we'd like to give a great big shout out to our patrons. Um, thanks guys, love the support, I really appreciate it. GameMath.eu, uh, lovely setup here. This is, yeah, great for them to be on board. Um, stuck with us almost since day one. And we've got Gap Games. Uh, we've got a 21% uh, affiliate link down below. Um, yeah, hit them up and if you need any hobby Stuff. Yeah, if you, need, <laughs> yeah. If you need new models, you know where to go. All right. Uh, today's mission, what are we doing? Recover the relics? Yeah, it's recover the relics. Um, so this is basically mission 11 from the Strike Force set in Nephilim. So this will be the last one we'll be playing for it. Mm -hmm. um, we've got six objectives on the board. Because there's no center objective, it's hold one, hold two, hold more. Should be good fun. Otherwise, you only get a CP if you happen to be holding an objective in No Man's Land or your opponent's zone. So you don't get a CP for just sitting on your home objective. Uh, on top of that, you get up to three points. You get one point for every enemy unit that you kill, up to a maximum of three per round. Awesome. Yeah. Um, as far as terrain goes, we went for something a little interesting. It is actually balanced, even though it looks, you know, not balanced. So we're basically saying that the rock here is a big old piece of obscuring, including the two little boulders. Move that a little bit across. So yeah, a little across. bit across. Yeah. And also the one big building on the city side of the map. Um, we're also saying ground floor blocks line of sight. If you're up against the wall, you can shoot through it. If you're like an inch behind, you can't. Um, the two vent panels here, we're gonna count as forests. So they're dense, difficult terrain, etc. And we've got a couple of these free floating um, power packs. Basically what we're gonna say is that if you're shooting across it, it counts as a barricade. So you just get light coverage between you and the opponent. Um, otherwise, everything else is a barricade or an area terrain or some ruins and is all pretty easy to work out. Yeah, we're gonna get into deployment. I have, I'm actually very excited because it's been a little while since I've had a game against yeah. Jack. Jack was like my local, we were, we were local friends doing local games even before we started Legends and Lore. Um, and so it's really good to have a game against Jack. It's been a little while because our schedules haven't quite lined up and I've never versus Thousand Sons. Yeah. So like, here's a whole army I don't know about. Here's a whole army that he doesn't know about. You guys What's can come happen? on an area of discovery with us and then not use the rules because they're going away. <laughs> <laughs> Can't follow this up, yeah. sadly. So we're going to get cracking in some deployment and we'll see you guys in a bit. Tiger List is actually not my usual style of play. Uh, it's a lot of really good guns which work well at medium range and a couple of guns that work well at short range. Jack's gonna have to be careful about what he chooses to get into combat. You'd be surprised at just how much damage heavy thunder hammers can do. Despite the minus one to hit, it means if any character or big thing or knight or vehicle happens to get in combat with them, they can pretty handily take it down. Uh, we have done the math and it turns out two thunder hammers can take out a knight in one go. That being said, I don't think that's gonna happen against the Scarab Cult <laughs> Jack's got a lot of AP scattered around. I haven't actually versed his Thousand Suns yet, so I'm really excited for this. There's Zangors, who I assume are gonna be pretty good in melee. Mostly, I'm just really worried about the absolute slabs of psychic powers that are gonna be coming my way. I don't have a lot up my sleeve to be able to deal with that. I've only got one deny, so maybe I'll throw some chapter traits around and see what comes up, but uh... Yeah, we're a little bit in the wind as far as just hoping to survive the Psychic Onslaught before we can dacker him good off the table. So we'll send these guys back to the warp and uh, we'll just say they're aliens the whole time. Obviously I'm bringing Magnus. First time out on the channel. Hope he doesn't die first turn, but we never know. <laughs> oh look, I've just tried to bring a mix of everything. I've tried to bring like the units that are good for 
T-Suns, you know, I've got the Scarabs, I've got the Rubrics, I've got the Exalted, I've brought Araman, the good, you know, reliable buffer. Um, yeah, I've just, and, and I brought a fair few Zangors just for, for bodies. So, yeah, I, I think I put, brought a pretty well-balanced list, so hopefully you get a good game here. Um, in regards to Chris's list, man, it's, I'm worried about the bit of the shooting. I, I am worried about Magnus' first turn getting knocked off, but as long as I can kind of keep him out of the way, he does have... Doesn't really have much range. So considering the um, the mission we're playing today, short board edges, we've got a long way to go. So I can probably keep out of range the first couple of turns, which which will suit me fine. And then hopefully can throw Magnus in when I need him to and, and go from there. All right, guys, we have deployed across the table. Um, Death Watch were pretty conservative over in that corner. Um, largely because that's where the terrain is and mm -hmm. also where Magnus wasn't. And then Magnus came up this end of the table anyway. So, um, Jack's put down a lot of Zangors here and there, a couple guys here and there. The big Terminator blob is right in the middle. Um, and the other ones are in Deep Strike. Mm -hmm. I've put my melee focused um, Proteus team in the Black Star and we'll see if we can drop them somewhere useful later in the game. Awesome. Um, otherwise, I guess we don't have any other pre-game strats, so it just comes down to no, the, the roll. The roll. Here it is. Are you do ready? We are. Oh, a, a one. Star, oh, strong star. All right, Jack's up first. Good luck. Uh, I do have a couple of pre-game bits I need to do. So I need to choose a chapter, mm -hmm. and I need to choose a battle focus. Mm -hmm. So, and I need to choose a doctrine because the Death Watch gets to do all those. So I'm actually going to choose Warded because you went first. Yep. Warded okay. means I get a five up, feel no pain against mortal wounds from psychic powers. Yep. So nice. that's one of the successor chapter ones. I figured I can switch into it. Let's give it a crack. Maybe I'll save a couple of buds. Otherwise, I'm going to choose the tactical doctrine for the first round. Yep. Um, so that means almost everything I have, except for a couple of heavy things, get the extra AP. Um, and as far as a battle focus, because I've got to choose a battle focus in case I switch back into uh, Xenos Hunters, I'm going to go elites anyway, because you've got a lot of a bunch of those and they're kind yeah. of dangerous. Yeah. Um, my Aquilas need to do some choices though. So, um, Aquila number one, which is the Hellblaster squad, um, is reroll once one against, no, nah, the Hellblaster, the Assault Hellblaster yeah. squad in the middle of the building. Um, they have reroll ones against troops. Mm -hmm. um, they're also going to have reroll ones against elites. Yeah. Um, <laughs> The melee Aquila squad, um, I'm going to do reroll ones against troops and reroll ones against HQ. Nice. So if I've got somewhere I can drop them to punch Magnus, we're going to give it a crack. Um, I get to redeploy. I get yes, to redeploy D3 units. Two. Now, I actually wanted to go second. I deployed to go second. So, <laughs> there's not a great deal that I'm actually going to do first turn. My pact. So, my chaplain dude. Yep. So, I'm just going to go for... I'll just go for plus one strength. That goes off. So, um, that plus one strength goes on to the Terminators. Yep, their, their weapon. Attacks. Yep. Cool. Uh, so, yeah, the Zangle's just going to hold tight for this turn because they're um, going to raise some banners. Magnus has put four rerolls onto the Terminators as per his Lord of the Planet of the Sorcerers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's... Command phase thing, but it doesn't matter. We know yeah. when it's supposed yeah. to go on. Um, and, yeah, that's that's onto the Psychic phase. So I've raised banners with uh, the Zangle group here, the Zangles here, and the, um, the rubrics at the back here. Cool, lovely. Awesome. Um, I'm just going to do a quick calculation of my... Um, cabal, points? cabal points. Yeah. yeah, so I've got two per two per squad. So I've got six, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. 19. So this sorcerer is going to do mutate on this. I'm pretty sure I'm turn. out of range to deny you. I would think so. 24. Yeah. Yep. It goes off on a four. Got it on a seven. So I've mutated. Mutated. Number two. Flip it. And so and we're going to do presage. Uh, so it goes off on a seven. Got it as well. So that is also going off on the terminator. That's plus one to hit. Yep. Uh, next up, we'll do uh, Glamour. 
So Glamour goes off on a six, I got a seven, mm -hmm. so that goes off. And that that's does. minus one to hit. Glamour will go on the Terminators for now. Um, the Exalted Sorcerer, I'll just do Dentures Five Storm. Just goes off, goes off mm -hmm. in the air, does nothing. It's a, it's a very impressive display. We're just seeing like, you know, reality <laughs> ripping yeah, and yeah, fireworks like it's, it's and 24, stuff. Like it's not, yeah, nah. there's nothing, there's nothing in range of anything. <laughs> um, yeah. uh, the Terminator's gonna do Imperial Guidance. So this goes off on a four, got a nine. Which does? Uh, just add six to their range. So just make sure that I'm in range for everything. Okay. And I'm over here. Sorcerer here, we'll just spend the four Cabal points, which is irrelevant in this turn. I'm just gonna go Echo, worth, Echoes of the Warp. Is it worth spending then? Because you already did enough of your thing, didn't you? Yeah, no, no. So Echoes of the Warp just gives me a CP. And that is all for my Psychic Phase. Um, pretty low key. Um, and just onto my shooting. I've only got one unit to shoot. So here we go. Uh, minus one because of dense, but you got plus one anyway. Cool. Let's go with the rocket launchers first. So I'm hitting on threes, but I get full rerolls due to Magnus. Hit with all. Um, strength nine. So we're on twos. Twos. Four, four. AP? Uh, is two. Yes, because you don't get... Why am I picking up your dice? I don't know, they're cursed. Uh, two becomes one, so <laughs> yep, I'm saving five. on fours. Yep. Failed three. Oh. Ugh. Uh, it's D3 damage. So yep. first one. Kills guy. Kills guy. Doesn't kill, kill a guy. guy. I'm going to do the soul reaper second. Um, so I'm hitting you on threes. So I get four rerolls. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh, I don't know if that was a two, I'll just reroll it. No. Um, so I'm strength seven, so I'm running on threes. Uh, so we've got two, four, six, seven. Seven saves uh, AP three, these ones. Three becomes two. So we're saving on five. Right. Not bad, but kills a guy, kills a guy, and one's left on one wound. And now all the storm bolters come. All the storm bolters. <laughs> yeah, we go, let's go half. We'll go half. All right, so I hit on, I hit on threes. Yep. Um, and then I'll wind you on threes, because I'm strength five. That was strength five on these guns, is it? Oh, no, he gets the plus the, one. The plus yeah. one, yeah. Yeah, so that's I'm just going to roll a couple of these. Yeah, just, yeah. No, he's dead. <laughs> so, and that's my turn. I scored at the end of the battle round, uh, of our battle round, but I did kill one unit in the turn. All right, cool, man. Cool. All my right. turn. All right, so for my command phase, um, I'm going to give full rerolls from the Watchmaster onto the Assault Hellblaster Squad. I'm gonna do my litanies. So, and that one failed. All right, so we've got plus one to hit going on the Assault Hellblaster Squad as well. Sure. My flyer, as it has flown over a unit, I get to drop some bombs on them. Mm. I'm gonna drop it on your Terminators at the front. So there's 10 in the squad, yeah? Uh, there is. Okay, so I get to roll 10 dice. Mm -hmm. If I roll any sixes, it's mortal wounds up to a maximum of six. Yeah, sure. So, bombs away! Bomb away. One, we've moved some people up to get some firing lines. The plane has rocketed to the other side of the table to hopefully be annoying next turn. I've left my Malleus squad where they are because I'm going to have to deal with um, the big boy later on. And my Assault Hell Blasters, who have the full rerolls and the plus one to hit, have normal moved um, out to be able to tag the uh, Terminators. Mm -hmm. Get Psychic Premorphic Resonance on the Malleus squad yep. at the back here. So what's that do, sir? Um, so that is plus one to hit for melee. Ooh, yeah. It is Overwatch on fives. Yep. And it's fight first. Yep, goes no off. problem. Cool. Otherwise, we're going to do armor of contempt, see if that goes off. It's funny, it's called the armor of contempt. Which it does. Yeah, armor of contempt and armor of like, contempt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, it's fortified by contempt, sorry. Yep. I'm going to put that on the assault hellblaster squad. Okay. Don't you already have a feel no pain? Oh, yeah, like it's a feel no pain for everything. For yeah, everything. For, yeah, 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 including all the bullets. Perfect. Yep, yep. Perfect. Done. Let's get cracking with some shooting. Let's do it. I'm going to shoot with the assault hellblasters. I am going to spend three CP for nice. the special armor of contempt one, which is 
any hit auto wounds. Yep, nice. So the thing that'll save you here will largely be the um, the invulnerable save yep. that you've got, but I figured they're a problem, they're most of your guns. They are most of my guns. Let's get cracking. So uh, so just before you keep going, so what's the damage profile of these weapons? So I am supercharging. Yep. They are damage two. Damage two. AP five, strength eight. Three CP for unwavering phalanx. Yep, which does. Minus one damage. Hellblasters, full rerolls, plus one to hit, so I'm still hitting on threes. Uh, yeah, plus one, minus one. Yeah, yeah, you're fine. What's this for? Oh, you're doing individually. I'm doing individually because they can nuke themselves. Yep. So. Cool. Cool. Going well so far. So far, so very good. Risky for this guy. Ah, too risky. One's melted. Risky roller, even. You could say. Yeah. <laughs> we'll call him Dalton. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so All right, cool. uh, I'm just going to use your dice for the other three. If I yeah, think. sure. Yeah, fine. So these are the bolt rifles. So it's only two dudes, isn't it? Because uh, the third guy's against the wall. Oh, of course. Yeah, sure. Yeah, well, he missed anyway. Yep. So, That's fine. All so right, all those cool. are just saves. Four ups and two ups. Yes, you're minus four. Minus five. Yeah, yeah. yeah no. no way. Quite successes. Two guys dead and one is a bit punched. On one, uh, one's on one wound. So yep. two and one. That's okay. It cost me three CP to do that. Um, let's see if I get any back. Yeah, Codex. Sure do. Cool, I'm up. I've got one. Yep. Heavy Intercessor Squad to shoot your Zangors because they're the only viable target. Yep. Yeah, everyone else can shoot both squads. Um, so we're hitting you on fours, re-rolling ones. Mm -hmm. Bunch of twos. Uh, wouldn't you want twos? Twos, yeah. Um, your troop, so uh, they are re-rolling ones. Okay, no three needed. go through. Uh, five. Whatever your... Uh, one dies, what good do you job. Mean? What do you mean, this guy here? Bang. <laughs> I'm gonna dump everything from the plasma squad into the rubric remain, marines, because everyone has a bead on them. Now, this squad is dominata, so they don't get rerolled ones to wound. So, they're hitting you on threes, rerolling ones. Yep. Two twos, and a reroll. Yep. Oh, sorry, um, I'm supercharging, because... Yeah, yeah. So, we're wounding on twos, not rerolling ones. Didn't matter. Everything. Uh, AP four, which goes to three, so you get a six up save, a five up save because of the um, How many range. you get? You got them all, didn't you? 20, 30, 40, 60. Yeah, that's eight. Eight. Five ups. Fives. Oh, man. Oh, squad's alive. Oh. My big old flybird. So I'm going to put the hurricane bolter into the Zangors yep. doing the action. I'm going to put the assault cannon into the twin linked assault cannon, into that sorcerer the over there. Yeah. And then I'm gonna Good put shot. the missile pods into the, to the terminators. The terminators back here. Yeah, sure. So we'll do the terminators first, the missile mm -hmm. pods. So it's 43 shots. One, two, three, four, five, <clears throat> six, seven, eight, nine. Nice. Nice. So we're hitting on threes, minus one, so I'm hitting on fours. Yep. Because of your spell. Yep. Ugh. 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 Two go through. Ugh. All right, strength five, so I'm wounding so on threes. threes yeah. Jesus. Did they see them? They dropped the bombs, but they they didn't do much. No, nah, it's not worth the CP. No, because I could kill one guy, but it's not worth it. That's definitely not worth anything. <laughs> Six, two, four. That's terrible. Six. All right, yeah, assault let, cannons let into your sorcerer. No, don't do that. Don't Hitting on threes. Yes. Ooh, bit That's of a drop. Kind of not, not so good either. Strength six, wounding so on threes. threes. Yeah. Drop two. Three, so saves, three saves at minus one. Doesn't matter, so it's just two up. Twos. Oh, ah! Saucy. We both made mistakes. So. Threes. I just assumed Zangles. you realized. Yep, so three's the wound. Fours. Three, it's strength six for the. Uh, oh, yeah. The four hurricane the, bolters? The hurricane bolter, so mm. fours. So three went through. Yeah. Uh, Zangor is the ones that are near Magnus. They lose all three. three die. I haven't killed a unit actually. You um, have not. No. No, no it's very close. Yeah, very close. We're we're both playing a little cagey. Normally with this this list, I can punch it out of the gate, but we'll uh, turn two is really where it's going to shine. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, end of the round, <coughs> I get uh, Wrath of Magnus because yep. I uh, 
did more psychic than yourself, which makes yep. sense. Just three. Uh, I did mutate one, so I just got this one here. Yep. Um, banners you is not next turn. Well, that's, yeah, that's the next three. turn. Three. That's the next turn anyway. Fair. Just put three circles down so we know how many banners. Yeah, I'll do it in uh, turn two. Yeah, okay, cool. Uh, so, the, yeah, and end of... Yeah, you haven't killed any units aboard the witch. Well, yeah, if you haven't killed units, you haven't killed them. We're getting there. Yep. All right, cool. So that's the end of the turn. Um, I get one for the tertiary, turn one. Because yep. I killed the unit. The heavy unit, yep. yep. That's it, turn two. Cool. Awesome. All right, let's get cracking. All right, uh, so a CP each. Yep. Okay, so let's just go <coughs> start with the command phase stuff. Let's do <clears throat> uh, plus one strength to the gun. Uh, it goes off, so it's going to go on the Terminators again. Mm -hmm. And we'll do Magnus's full rerolls to go onto the Terminators. Mm -hmm. uh, primary, I'm holding one, two, three. Yep, it's more because I wasn't able to get on others, so you get a full 12. Yeah. Uh, summary of my turn, my movement phase. I moved the sorcerer back here. I'm a little bit worried about him getting knocked off. Um, I just moved my terminators out a little bit. I needed to get a beat on to get everyone in range of this squad here. Mm -hmm. um, and then essentially I'm just going to try and um, shoot the Corvus until it opens up and then see what, what goodies are inside. So, so here we go. Banners. Yep. Um, yeah, get uh, three, three banners. I've got one, two, three for my banners. So. Good old 12. Uh, good old 3. I hope it's not 12. 12. Wow! Arcs of Omen really changed the scoring! Uh, I've cooked the books over here. Um, yeah, no, nah, that's, that's uh, 3 there. And uh, yeah, that's... I've got my Terminators I could bring down this turn. I could just come down and put pressure. Yeah, let's do it. I'll take the bait. Uh, so that's all for the movement. On to the Psychic phase. Let's just go with what needs to happen. So I'm going to do Mutate Landscape right here. Uh, so that goes off, so yep. I've mutated that one. Echoes of the Warp. So for four Cabal points, I should get them out. So it goes off, I get an extra CP for doing that. Yep. I'm gonna use the Exalted Sorcerer. Yep. So he's gonna use his Rahiti on this um, attack. So he gets to roll three dice and yep. just drop the lowest. Yep. So his Ancient Firestorm goes up on a five, but if I roll a natural nine. Yes, you uh, get it. gets better. So I roll an 11. Yep. Beautiful. Uh, so I'm rolling nine dice. Yep. And five's immortals. Uh, for two. Two. Two mortals onto the... Sucks one up. It takes one wound, so I'm 13. 13. Because I'm still warded. Gaze of hate. It goes off. Uh, so this is... Uh, every four is immortal. Uh, so just two, two mortals. Takes two. I'm going to go with glamour off this sorcerer. Which so this does? Is, this is the minus one to hit, which yep. I'll put on... The Terminators are a big power piece that I need to like, sit in the open. So we're going to put on the Terminators. Everyone's in right. Everyone's <coughs> within 24 of this foot here, I believe. Yeah, they would be by now. They would be, yeah. Uh, then they'll just do a smite. So I've done yeah. uh, no smites at this stage. So first smite. Goes off. Goes off on a 10. So D3. just D3. I'll just reroll that. For a two. Two. Sucks up one. Sucks one. I might just do Doom Bolt here. Yeah, and what does Doom Bolt do? So Doom Bolt is just, uh, it goes off on a five, so you can just, it's, yeah, you definitely go for use an eye. Yeah. Uh, it's just straight three mortal wounds if it goes off. Okay. So it goes off on a 10. No. Yep. Sorry, who are you casting it on? Uh, this unit here. Okay, so. Just the closest model. So I'm actually then, sorry, just, just bear with me. I'm going to spend four more Cabal points. Yeah. To do an extra D3 mortal wounds. So five in total. Suck up two. One guy dies, one takes one wound. Mm -hmm. Araman and Magnus. I'm going to go with Magnus next. Yep. Come on, smite. So I want to, I want to super smite this one if I can. Um, one more on three dice. Super, it's two. It's just two. But he gets a plus something to plus cast. Plus two. Him. Plus two to cast. Need nine. Nope. Um, I'm four, going to reroll it. He can reroll his. Reroll. So reroll that. Uh, Seven, eight, nine, ten. And then plus one for being a thousand times. 3d3. 3d3. Yeah, here it comes. And go. Oh. Three, six, seven, eight. Eight. Dun, 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 dun. Eight, seven, six, five. Five, yep. Down to five. So I'm going to spend eight Cabal points to cast Doom Bolt a second time. Okay. Just as it, it actually auto goes off. Yep. Yep, so, so flat three. Flat three. 
saves two. Yeah, two. Got one, takes one. He's down to four. And he's got one more psychic power. He's just going to do temporal manipulation. Which does? Uh, it heals um, hey, this guy. This guy, D3. In, D3. Yeah, so goes back to full. I can reroll it. Like two. But it's two was what you wanted anyway, yeah, so. That's fine. Cool, all right. Just Araman. Who do Glamour, which is going to help out the Terminators. That goes on the Terminators for a four up invo. Yep. <clears throat> he has got Presage for a plus one hit. That goes up on the Terminators again. And he's going to do a Smite. Now I've done Smite how many times now? Twice, I thought. Uh, twice or three times. We'll just roll, see what I, see what I get. Uh, yeah, it doesn't 10 matter. 10 will go it. off. Yep, so just a normal Smite. D3. Uh, yeah, D3, it's not even worth knocking around at this stage. Just for a single, a five. Sucks it up! Yo! Still alive, survive the psychic phase. Need to add more inscriptions to that. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Not good. All right, cool. I'll just start with the Terminators in the corner here, because nothing else to do. They're going to shoot heavy to the Hellblasters. Sure. Here we go. Three. Get on threes. Are you on fours? So, fours. fours. Um, none of them are in cover, so no. two die. One's left on one wound. Uh, the second Rubik squad. Yep. Yep. Same deal. So same deal. Uh, so I'm hitting you on fours. fours. I get to roll the one there. Uh, so I'm winning on fives with the pistols for two. Two. Two saves. Negative two. Takes two. Takes two. Down to one. Mm -hmm. Oh, here comes the Soul Reaper. Come on, don't make me split five my terminators. Uh, fours, hitting on fours. Yep, winning on fives. Winning on, fi oh, winning on fives. Winning on fives. One goes through. One. Minus three. Double. Ah! <clears throat> yeah, I reckon, I reckon we'll just let it explode. No! Do not do that. Okay. All right. So we're going to shoot all the infernal bolt guns into this squad here. Of, what is it? Proteus. Yeah. yeah. And I'm going to shoot the uh, the Soul Reapers and the missile launchers into this uh, Proteus melee squad. Okay, cool. Cool. Do you want to do those first? Uh, yeah, we'll do them first. I'm actually going to spend as well, sorry, uh, 2 CP um, for Wrath of the Wronged. Yep, which This just does. gives me plus one to wound. Alrighty, so we're going to go with the missiles into the the far away squad. Yep. yep. Um, so, four. Uh, so I'm hitting you on twos. Threes. Uh, twos. So twos, plus yep, one to hit. plus one. And I get to reroll from Magnus. Yep. All and in. Three twos. Twos. Get a one. Uh, so three go through at minus two. Well, two become minus one. Um, I will take him on the Terminator because that's his job. Yep, sure. Um, so three ups. Yep. Cool. Uh, Loves it all. Good start. Turny. Reapers. Uh, the Reapers, yep. Uh, so we're talking twos with rerolls. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Twos again. No rerolls. Like that. So that'll be nine. Nine, yeah, nine. Nine. I've got one. Yeah. Right. Nine minus threes this time. Three becomes minus two, so I'm saving on <coughs> fours. Yep. Do them three at a time. So he's taken one. Mm-hmm. Dude, he's tough. Two. Two. So three left. Oh. Is that worth the CP? No one's wrapped in, Mecca. Yeah, I got a one in three chance of getting that CP back this round. No, I don't think it is. And fives. Oh, and the bike yeah. sucks up the rest. So only the Terminator dies. And Storm now there's Storm Bolters. Uh, so we are hitting on three. Three rerolling. Oof. Yeah. So, oh, they're like all these ones. Two. So I just roll this six at a time. So one dies. I've got four left. Uh, two dies. One wound. Okay, now that guy's die. The rest are on fours. Mm -hmm. uh, so another one dies. So, so four in total. Charging. Charging. Obviously, I use magnets first. Yeah. All right, All right so, so um, twos. Yep, all, all hit. 
And twos. And twos. I'm just going to roll your dice and hope uh, sixes. Six. No, no, you had one, one. Yeah. Okay. <coughs> sixes. One, two. two. So four die. Do the sorcerer first. I should have saved the CP for interruption here because I could have smacked Magnus. Um, uh, that's three wounds. Mm. It's minus one, mm. so it's negated. Um, They're yeah, fine. So you're fine. And then the, the two rubrics. Two rubric marines hit with... Uh, threes? Yeah, threes. Yep, yeah. wound on fours. Uh, two. Just for normal saves. Yeah. One. Takes one damage. One damage. Is that worth the CP? No, it's not. Um, here we go. These angles into the... Um, what? Into the squad. Kill team. Into the kill team. <laughs> yeah, kill team. It's got everyone. So, uh, so I hit on fours. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay. You might survive. Fours. Uh, for four, four saves. AP? One, but that doesn't matter for you. They might be okay. You might be definitely okay. So threes. I hope they all make it because I want to hit you with some hammers. Uh, that is not all making it. It's not worth the CP considering how many squad is left. So we are going to lose the sergeant. But yep. I get to black hit, shield. I get to hit you with a hammer with the black shield. Yeah. Um, because of the plus one, he's hitting on threes. What's the plus one for? Because oh, they've naturally got a weapon skill of two on yep. black shields. So he's going to be hitting you on threes instead with heavy thunder power. Yep. I'm going to go into Magnus because yeah, screw that guy. Why not? Um, so hitting you on threes. Yep. Uh, no rerolls. Three go through. Mm -hmm. Strength is eight, so I'm wounding you on threes and threes. re rolling ones because yeah, yeah. I chose Purgator as for. No, not Purgator, but anyway, HQ as their other one. Does it so, three all go, go through. through. Invon saves for four damage apiece. Whoa, four ups. Oh, four damage. Make two, one goes through. Four. Uh, so he does have minus one damage, yep. so that just goes down to. Just yeah, so I, I would just like to roll eight. a one. You need to roll a one. If I yeah. roll a one, that's you roll good. a one, you're fine. No, oh, quite no, the opposite. That is definitely not a one. <laughs> okay, so how do you feel that went? Um, I felt like that squad took a lot of beating. Like, yeah. Like obviously they only died to morale, not by my. Yeah. Like like by my hand, but not by my hand directly. <laughs> like, yeah. Indirectly. I mean, next turn I would have gotten like if two hammers had survived, all these guys above, they actually do really well. You yeah. save pretty well against it. Did you do any end of turn scoring? Yeah, cool. Uh, so uh, at the end of my turn, I get two for Wrath of Magnus because I didn't I didn't actually cast a Malediction this turn. And I got three for Mutate as I mutated my home base objective. Hmm. That's it. Cool. All right. I have to do the Chapter Master buff. Um, so again, I'm going to put that on. I'm going to put the full rerolls on the Plasma Squad. Yep. Nice. Okay. I am going to change my chapter tactic mm -hmm. to white scars, which allows me to advance and not suffer the penalty for advancing and firing assault nice. weapons. Nice. Okay. Um, on top of that, I've got some lidnings to do. They do have a minus one on them though, through Gaima. That's okay. Yeah, that's cool. Okay, so both lidnings have gone off. So we're gonna put plus one to hit on the plasma squad. Mm -hmm. We're gonna plus, put plus one to wound the closest on the Hellblaster squad. Yep, perfect. Um, All right. Primary. Primary. Uh, I am on one of two. two objectives, so I get eight. So we have advanced the plasma squad forward to get everyone in shoot sting range. Mm. Here, which is 24. Yep. Yep. Um, we've advanced the Hellblaster squad mm -hmm. um, over onto that objective. <coughs> we get a couple of tags. We've advanced the Melter squad. I still haven't used the Beacon Angelus yet. What's that do? Uh, it allows me to teleport a squad to my chaplain. Oh, nice. Psychic phase. All right, so I'm going to cast. Um, the five up feel no pain. I'm yep. going to put it on the assault hellblaster squad. Mm -hmm. Goes off on an eight. Do you want to try and deny that one? Yeah, yeah let's go for it. Yep, you're fine. Goes off. Cool. Um, otherwise, premorphic resonance, which is going to go on the 
let's quarter the back. What's that do? Uh, it goes off. So that's um, plus one to hit, fight first, Ooh, and easy. Overwatch on five plus. Nice, nice, nice. Double. Right. Two. Cool. What are you trying to say is you're unchargeable. Is what you're <laughs> in, in layman's terms. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's Don't good touch. I haven't got the frag cannon, but yeah. So, we're going to shoot the Malleus squad into your rubrics. Yep. Um, terminators? Yeah, the rubric terminators. Scarab Occult Terminators. Scarab Occult Terminators. Threes? Yep. Ooh, is that from two? advancing? You still... They ignore it. They because ignore white scars. Yeah, yeah, sure. Um, so they're wounding you on twos. Cool. No problem. Uh, AP is five. So five out of Is that one. all? Just... <laughs> I made one. I uh, made one. Three, Three damage. Yeah, just... Kills a guy. Hey, mate. Cool. All right, we're going to switch over to the Plasma Squad. Yep. Okay, so it's just nine shots then. Yep. Um, I've got plus one to hit you, you've got minus one. Yep. So hitting on threes, full rerolls. Um, I'm supercharging. Yep. Because I might as well. Yeah, I can't, um, I can't do the minus one damage this time. So, threes. And rerolls. So. One miss. Yeah. Sure. Okay. you on twos, rerolling mm -hmm. ones. Yeah, nice. Cool. Actually, I didn't even need the plus one to wound um, on these guys. But oh, uh, everything oh, no, the goes plus one to wound you put on the other. The You're correct. I did. Um, uh, so one, two, three, four, right, five, six, back, seven, mate. eight. Right. Eight at your eight? end bone for yeah. two damage a piece. Yeah, this is not going to be too healthy. Uh, so they're four ups, these ones, because I put yes. the um, Weaver. One, two, three. So, um. One, two. No, I healed him. Yeah, so, so. One, two, and apart. We'll switch over to the um, Assault Hell Blasters. Mm hmm. Um. So they're going to also supercharge and drop everything into these guys. Yep. So I've got four guys left. These guys don't get the re-rolls of ones. I think it's worth the risk to try and do as much damage as I can to this squad. So. Yeah. First fours. Two. Good start. Fours. Okay. Second guy dies. Good hitting so far. So far. Was that a four? Did I bump that? Uh, I, 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 I believe I it was. Yeah, I yeah. believe I believe yeah. so far it's all been hits. Okay. Two misses. Yeah, that's and four dudes, and then the, and the last one. guy. Yeah, so that's one, two, three. This is the fourth hell blaster. Two misses. Yep. And then I'll just do the bolt guy first. So he hits. Yep. Uh, when you on fours. Yep. Plus one to wound. So threes. Threes because closest to enemy target. Yep. Um, they chose elite, so rerolling ones. Okay, so three go through at AP one. Ah, uh, he's fine. Alright, these are wounding on twos, mm -hmm. rolling ones. Cool. Yeah. Uh, so it's one, two, three, four, six, seven at your four up in bomb. Mm -hmm. Two damage a piece. Mm -hmm. All of them. Ah, no good. One, Terrible. Two, roll. three. So one, Great. two. So that kills one guy. Yep. That kills a guy. It kills a guy. So, it's... so I'm going to pick up two and another one goes to a half. So my watchmaster is going to shoot the Zangors because he doesn't have much of a better target. Yeah, sure. Pew, pew, on twos. Yep. Pew, on fours. Got it. Uh, AP Five. two. Ah, oh, what about LNL? And then the heavy blaster is going to shoot your... No, it's going to go far. Long shot. Yep. So I'm going to supercharge because he's got two wounds. He does. So... so is it this guy? Yeah. Yep, the, the heavy hell blaster. So he's having I'm a hitting shot. on fours. Hitting on fours. Rerolling ones. Yep, sure. My boy! No, no good. Wounding on twos? Yes. He's troop, re-rolling ones. Runs. Oh, so that's almost a guaranteed. Let me just go Two through. sixes. Now Jack rolls a six. What? Ah, oh, one! <laughs> Terrible! <laughs> no, he just dies. <laughs> all right. Um, that's all my shooting, as it turns out, because you killed a lot of my stuff. Mm-hmm. So we're going to start with the heavy thunder hammer. Yeah, naturally. Okay. Naturally. With the plus one to hit, he's hitting on twos. Ouchie. Because this is a black shield. Mm hmm Everything. All hit. Uh, wounding on twos. Mm hmm Dropped two. Oh, yucky. I have got CP left. Do, I think this is worth it. So I'm going to spend one to re-roll yeah. that. Cool. Nice. Do I get CP back? You yes. Do. So let's just keep yours. All right. Um, that's minus three. So you're five up inbound. Yeah. Yeah. So four ups to not die. Come on. Oh, nice job. Lose one completely. Yeah, just evaporated. Yeah. Chainswords. Yes. So, um, hitting you on twos. 
Uh, when you're on fours. So six. six at AP one, which you ignore. So right. saving on twos. Uh, take, the one. <coughs> take a wound. I'll fight back here. Yeah, go for it. Yeah. Uh, so we'll go two of the, the two Terminators first. I hit you on uh, threes. Yep. And then I'm strength five. The threes. The three. Three minus threes. Okay, so saving on fives. Mm -hmm. What's the damage each? Three. Uh, two, two, two. Two. So two guys die. Sorcerer. Uh, hit with two. Strength seven. Uh, one. Minus one, so you normal save. Yep, cool. Cool. How do I feel about it? Well, I would have liked the melee squad to have done a bit more damage to Magnus. Um, I shouldn't have spent the CP on Overwatch. I should have saved it for an interrupt. Yeah. Because uh, in doing so, I think I would have had three Thunder Hammers, and I reckon that would have might have even killed him. It would have been. It could have well, got him close. very, very, got very, very close. close. Yeah, I didn't realize how strong they were. <laughs> and if I had my time again, I would have actually just shot everything from the Terminator into him. Yeah, which so, I was hoping you wouldn't. Um, yeah. So my bad on doing an Overwatch. I wasn't thinking, and uh, I probably shouldn't have because then Magnus would probably be down to like three wounds. Yeah, he'd definitely be a lot more sore. Than um, right now. Yeah, made a mistake with where I positioned guys in the middle of the table, but that was a misunderstanding on both disciplines. So we all learned together. Um, otherwise, I would have liked to have gotten the. Sergeant into combat at the back with those Terminators. Yeah. Um, I still get a, another crack here. Yep. So we'll see how we go with uh, pylons <clears throat> and stuff. Yep. Um, so yeah, I don't think I'm in a great position considering how many psychers you've got left on the board. Uh, and you've rolled very well on your saves. So points. Um, I killed the unit. You did. You did. <laughs> so you got, you got one for the top here. Yep. I got one for the tertiary. And you got, the witch. Yeah, you got two for the ball of the witch. Yep. Yeah. Cool. I actually get two, I killed two units. All right, so you destroyed two, so you get two points for yep. that. Two for that. Yep. Uh, yeah, uh, primary, I'm you still holding again. more. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah, because I abandoned the number one objective. And we're going to do the pact to get plus one strength for my gun. Got it. Yep. Onto the Terminators. Um, and that is all for my command phase stuff. Movement phase, uh, so I've pushed Magnus up, I've pushed the, um, the Terminators up. Uh, I've left these angles just here because they're just safe for now. Um, mm -hmm. He has to come closer to me to do anything. Uh, shuffle the rubric just ever so slightly. They may not even be in range of everything after the psychic phase, potentially. Um, and I've also brought the Exalted around. They can't move and yeah, that's that's all I've got. So yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. Onto the psychic. Um, my most important, not most important, but one of my important spells is to get my mutate landscape off. So I did get that off on my objective there. And that's through the uh, rubric squad that I did that. Uh, Glamour of Zinch. Which is the? Uh, minus one to hit. And that's gonna go off on Magnus. I'm gonna do Doom Bolt. Yep. Uh, so it goes off on a five. Goes off. Is that one? See, as soon it's as you said that, I'm like, yeah, have a choice. <laughs> like... So this is three, this is three damage. Plus if I use four Cabal points, it goes Three yeah, I reckon this three. one's more worthwhile. Yeah, this one's pretty good. So, so I rolled a um, seven. So it's yep. plus one. So I need an eight. Oh. No, no. Uh, so yeah, I will. Is that worth a reroll? Anyway, I'm gonna reroll that. Yeah, I'm gonna reroll that. Sure. Oh, oh, oh so close. Unlucky. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm gonna spend the four here because to do not? an extra D three. Yeah. It's an extra D three. So it's D three plus three. Uh, so yeah, so it's six, six, six mortals. So I lose three guys. So I might even spend a command point here as well to cast again. I'm just going to cast smite. Oh, perils, perils. Um, CP reroll. Yeah, CP reroll. Goes uh, off. Goes off. D three. Just uh, D three. Yep. For two. Just another, another guy. Uh, I'll go with Araman. Sorry. Next. Yep. Cool. So he'll just do smite. Yep. <clears throat> um. I've just gone off, what I've used it once. So, uh, so that goes off. Five, six, seven. So it goes yep. off on five so on six. So yep, go for it, D3. Yeah. Uh, D3, for three. Uh, one guy dies. Weaver of Fates, goes off on an 11. So that just puts a four up invo on the Terminators. Mm -hmm. And Presage, goes off on eight. Doesn't go off, I get the rear off Araman. 
Uh, actually, it might be a seven, not an eight. Seven, which I got. Yep. So I got a plus I'm one. So this is plus, what? plus one to hit. Okay. On the Terminators. Uh, from the Rubric Marines. Also. Yeah. Four ritual points to do uh, plus one CP. There goes off. So now I'll just do a smite here. So I've done how many smites from now? your Terminator. From the Terminator. So I've done one, two. This will be the third. Yeah. So five, six, seven. Uh, it doesn't go off. Yep. Yeah. And then <coughs> Magnus. Uh, Magnus. I'll start with the smite first, which will go into the yeah to the squad there. So Hellblasters. Yep. Hellblasters. Fails. He's with yeah. plus, but he gets yeah, the reroll on. Uh, five, so five, six, seven, three. eight. So it's just, just a normal one? Yeah, it's just a normal one. Yeah. Uh, just, uh, so D6 for three? D3. Oh no, D6 normal one is, is, yeah. Normal one is D6. Yeah. Um, another one dies. Baleful de-evolution. So mm -hmm. this is a warp charge eight. So I'm targeting the squad in the middle though. Um, nope. Doesn't go off, I just gotta reroll that. Does he get to reroll everything or reroll once? I just get rerolls his sucking power. Uh, so you got a seven. So I get to roll a dice for as many as I rolled. <clears throat> yep. So uh, seven, and you got plus three. So yep. So every six is D three mortals. Every six is D three mortals. Wow. Yeah. D three mortals. D three mortals. You can do like forty mortal wounds with that. Kind of. Yeah. Does it have a cap? No, no cap. What? I'll read it out. Which fire baleful de evolution, the warp charge value of eight. If manifested, select one in a minute within 18, invisible to the psyker. They contain six or more models. Roll a number of D6 equal to the result of the psychic test. For each six, that enemy suffers D3 models. So I've got three sixes. Holy crap! Four, six D3. Three, four, five, six. God! Yeah, it's quite strong. <laughs> And normally with him, you can actually like really pump it. I only rolled a ten. I only rolled. Yeah, 10 you dice. rolled low. That's what I was saying. You could roll. If you rolled like 12, 13 dice, like I rolled above average to get three, right? So that was, that was pretty. It was, yeah, that, that was a good result. You'll you'll average like <clears throat> six to fifteen mortal wounds out of that one spell. I'm just gonna do Zinch's fire storm. Yep. Uh, I'm gonna just do it into the chaplain. It's a targetable one. Yes, it is. So cool. it just goes off on normal. Yep. And Firestorm does? Six, this six is mortals this time. So just one, two mortals. Um, shooting. Shooting phase, Soul Reaper. So hit on threes. Nice. Strength six. So threes, oof. Uh, five minus threes. What's the damage each? Singles. Uh, uh, so one dies. One. Yeah, one dude. Yep. All right, cool. And then I'll just shoot the Terminators into the Unit squad in the middle? here. Yeah. I got, uh, so twos are only ones. Yep. Uh, yep. Uh, strength four. So two, four, six, six minus twos. Four ups. Fours. No, two damage piece? Singles. Singles. All right, two guys die. And then I'll do the guy who's not in, not shooting through cover. Uh, hitting on twos, strength six, running on threes. Two damage piece? Single. Okay. So one and a half. Then he'll do his rocket launcher. So he did one and a half there. Oh, get that out your way. Uh, so pin on twos, get three or ones for Magnus. No, still missed. Uh, when you're on uh, twos, yep. So just one save. Got it. Got it. it. And now the <coughs> the white the Soul Reaper that's got uh, martial to hit. So he's hit on threes. So you get a three or the ones. No. And then strength six, strength six, three, three minus three. Uh, uh, save just, two, fail one for yeah. one damage. That should, yeah. And then the rocket launcher. One. Three other ones. So I hit one on hit. threes. Yeah. Uh, strength eight. So. Failed it. He's dead. Yep. Yeah. I'm just going to charge the Terminators into Hellblasters. So you need an eight. What did I need? An eight? Yeah. Uh, no. Nah. Do you want to CP it? Um, yeah, I've got nothing better to do. Yeah. CP. No. Nah. One to zero. Just gonna do the heavy thunder hammers first. So threes and fours. Drop one there, drop one there. Cool, swap those colors out. Mm-hmm. When you're on twos. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Might not be so lucky this time. Saving on five. five. No fours because of the armor Doesn't contempt. Matter. Lose four. Three, four five. Yep. No. Hooray. <laughs> No. Um, consolidation doesn't matter, but guess what? Whoop, there we go. <laughs> like most of my army's janked anyway, and yeah, I'm just gonna insane bravery it. 
yeah. There's, yeah. There's, there's literally nothing much else I can do in the game since so much of my stuff is dead. <laughs> End of the turn, I only scored two again for Wrath of Magnus. I got the three for Mutate. I scored three for Banners and... You didn't kill a unit. Um, I did not kill any units, no. So I got nothing for that. Ah, <sighs> CP. Start of the round. Start of the round. So, I get one. Full rerolls are going to go onto the Plasma Squad. Yes. In the middle of the table from the Chapter Master. Um, otherwise, the Chaplain's going to do a plus one to hit and plus one to wound on the Hellblaster the Squad. Blasters. Cool, they both go off. Oh, so your primaries, you were... Oh, I was on, I'm two. on one, two. Also, because my Watchmaster is still alive, something else I want to do. Just for funsies, because I'm, mm -hmm. I'm not going to do well here. Um, I'm going to spend a CP because I've got a Watchmaster that's alive. Mm -hmm. um, oh, do I get that back? No. Um, to change the battle focus, I'm just going to change it to heavy slash Lord of War mm -hmm. slash transport. Yep. And I'm just going to shoot Magnus a lot. <laughs> All right. So movement wise, the Hellblasters have stayed where they are. Mm -hmm. The Dominata squad have moved up the table. Mm -hmm. The... Watchmaster has moved over towards the Zangors. The Chaplain has jumped over to this side of the table mm -hmm. um, and then used the Beacon Angelus to pull the Malleus squad uh, next to him, which puts me within range of the Melter Guns to shoot Magnus. Magnus, all right. First up, we've got a Psychic phase to do. Yes, you do. So I'm going to put Premorphic Resonance on the Dominata squad. Yep. That's the Melters? No, that's the Plasma, plasma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Goes off. Yep. Uh, I don't think you can deny from that range. And he's going to put the 5 up Feel No Pain on the Dominata squad. Yep. Also goes off. No problem there. Cool. Alright. Shooting. I'm going to start with the Melters. Mm -hmm. So we've got three Melters all going into Magnus. No rerolls because my Watchmaster went elsewhere, but mm -hmm. that's okay. Two go through. Yep. Beauty. I'm wounding on threes three. with a full reroll. Yeah. Okay. Looking good. Involves. Force, force needed. Come on, Magnus. I'll re one, re one of these, probably. No! no I don't need to roll oh, nothing. Well. Don't roll nothing. Leave it there. <laughs> Leave All it right. there. I'll get Maggie. Um, the Plasma Squad, the Dominata Squad, mm -hmm. is going to shoot the Terminators. Yep. Threes. Uh, yep. So and wouldn't you on threes? Threes. Yeah. With three rolls. And. No. Yep. Take a damage. Yep. Lose Take a guy. Damage. Oh. <laughs> Um, the Hell Blasters, but I'm going to see if I can shoot Magnus more. <laughs> sure. <laughs> so, I'm going to supercharge because the game's lost anyway. He's dead. His friend's very dead. <laughs> Both of them get nude. So, fours. Ooh, Both go double through. L's. Double yeah, L's. Go. Come on. Oh, fail Four mode. damage. He's down to 11. You know what? I've got a heavy hell blast. He might as well supercharge and shoot Magnus as well. Yeah. So. He hits. Not time. We got a three. Wounds. Wounds. Fours. Oh, come on. I'll roll. I'll roll up. Fours. Ah, no. Nah. One wound. So he's got minus one damage as well. Yeah, uh, that's it. Warlord trait. Undy undying. undying something. Oh, no, wait. Two damage. Got a supercharge. Yeah, yeah. Let's see if I can maybe make some charges. So, uh, hitting on twos and threes. Two's for the pink dice, three's for the others, four rerolls. Yeah, cool. Oh, yeah. yeah. Winning on twos, okay. rerolling ones. That's cool. efficient. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, make those saves. Four. four. <laughs> uh, you eight. can see why the squad that I had from the plane earlier yeah, can, can be really. Could've, I should have just interrupted. Could have been so powerful. Ah, oh, yeah, dead. I shouldn't even roll that. Yeah, yeah right. I'm currently only holding two objectives and will very shortly have no models left in the middle of the table. Do we want to call it there? <laughs> All right, so end of game. Um, I learned a lot about Thousand Suns. Actually my first time playing against them. Yeah, that was rough. So, yeah. Um, 
I like. Let's do a score and then we'll talk about how the game went. Okay, we'll just let's do a tally go. here. Uh, in score is uh, Thousand Suns ninety five, uh, Death Watch fifty seven. So it's higher than I thought I'd be, considering how much stuff you plinked off the table. Yeah, I just, I, 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 yeah, I definitely didn't see that happening. Mm. Um, you know, I was well, lucky with the mission role that it was a, it was long deployment zones were so far apart. Yeah, I was able to hide Magnus for the start of the game and then bring him out. That really once, helped. Yeah. Once I'd already killed most of the things that could kill him, he became a big pain. I think for mm. for Maka to to deal with. Yeah. Um, I think like that that Terminator squad, I could have leveraged some stuff better. I think if you didn't get first turn, yeah, the Terminator squad you would have redeployed over there, but they wouldn't have had the minus one to hit, they wouldn't have had a four up in bolt. Yeah, yeah, it so, doesn't have any of this buffs up. Yeah, yeah could, could have hit a bit harder there. Your your psychers do really well. You've got a lot, so many of them. So many spells. <laughs> As per Thousand Suns. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, nah, definitely was a, quite a strong game and mm. yeah. I'm not sure throwing the uh, plane in, in over here was, was, was as the, worth was it. The core. It was basically bait to do exactly what you did. Yeah. But then I didn't save my interrupt. So I reckon yeah, this so like, yeah, you done you done everything right, except for you should have, yeah, not yeah. not overwatched. Um, yeah, whereas I could have had the plane fly yeah, think, over yeah, to the Zangles on the left. Yeah. Taken out the Zangles with all its bullets just by focusing down. Yeah. Um, and then drop the squad down. They've got obsec, take out the yeah. Marines and then like work their way sideways. Mm. So I figured because you had this this complex here and you and it would kind of almost be silly to move out too quickly. I kind of didn't need to worry about this side so yeah. much. Like you weren't going to come this way. So I knew that I thought if I, I just knock out this side here and I sit around here, yeah. you still have to come to me. Mm. And just with, I, I also believe in secondary choices. So my secondaries, I kept ones that I could, like I got the one that I did banners yep. and I did mutate. So I, I knew I was going to get, you know, at least a, a semi-decent yeah. score yeah. while still sitting around where I was. Mm. Whereas it was the onus was on you to come forward and you yeah. had the kill secondary. So you, you actually had to come to me and kill. Now, if mm. you didn't and you stayed here, it, it played into my game because I only have to, I have to score on my end. Yeah. So I, I think in secondary choices, they actually did, they were opposite. Like yours was come towards mine or stay still, but yeah. I, I'd stayed still and you didn't come as forward. No, well, you, you got first turn. I kind of had to swing yeah. this way a bit more because that squad just didn't die I just, enough. I just, yeah, because yeah. then, then as soon as I saw that, I, I, I thought my, this is my way in on this side, I kind of put, well, mm. I put Magnus there and then I put the big Terminator brick there. Yeah. And I didn't feel like I had to defend this side as, <clears throat> as heavily mm. as, as that side. Yeah, I couldn't really... I was, out that way. I was trying to work out a way that I could, because you could, you could teleport in. I think me moving forward wasn't worth it. I could have chosen a different Death Watch secondary to while you're outside of six inches from my deployment zone. Yeah. I get like five points. Okay. Or something like that. Um, can't get in the first round, but if I could have just like, just stopped you and just, just had you it. come towards me. Yeah, yeah. Slowly. I was worried that if I did that, you would have just like, just torn me to shreds with psychic like, powers yeah. anyway. The, um, the, the thing is with the psychic powers, I don't have that much range and because you're a, you're a short range army too, Yeah. when I get into that range for me to do damage, I'm, I'm putting myself in, if I don't do the kill, mm. which you saw there, I only did 10 wounds with my whole army to a, a Corvus Blackstar. Like, yeah, but you did like 8 wounds with a single sorcerer to he did, he did a, he, the unit They, the they back, do, yeah. but they're, those, he's, he's kind of built to do that kind of, mm. he's like my little missile. <laughs> yeah, so like you yeah. know what I mean. So it's just yeah, just 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 different. You, I mean, you haven't played the uh, this army. Either. I've played, I haven't played your this army, but I've played mm. Space Marines before. So I kind of, I know what I'm in for in that regard. So yeah. it's definitely probably a learning curve. Cool. All right. But well, um, yeah. last question before we get into the outro stuff. Um, Ark of Omen. It will yeah. it should literally be out by the time this video comes yeah, out. Yeah, it'll be out by the time. So um, is there anything you're looking forward to? Does it change much? With my army. Yeah. Um, so there's a handful of points reductions, uh, which is pretty cool. Uh, nothing goes up in points, which is, I guess you could say a bonus. Um, losing Arm of Contempt, it's, it's a two-sided coin, right? So like, a problem is, is that uh, I've got AP2 sh shooting in my basic gun. So mm -hmm. shooting into Armor of Contempt makes them a slightly weaker. So I'm pretty happy with that. Obviously, the defensive buff of AOC is is good, but I've already got the defensive buff from all this dust, so mm. I'm already strong against, say, damage on weapons anyway, getting a plus one to my save. Yeah. So I'm actually not that worried about losing AOC as, as some armies are. Mm. Uh, so I think it, it on that side, it's a bit of a buff. Um, for the people that play really competitive Thousand Suns that have been subbing in the um, the Demon Detachment, 
obviously they've been nerfed uh, slightly mm. with the flamers not being flamers anymore, just um, having to roll to hit. Yeah. But I mean, they're still, the thing is though, they're still a cheap unit. They got a three up save from shooting always, and they still got three wounds, and they're still 25 points a model. They're still a good, actually, unit. So yeah. you'll probably still see them getting subbed in, but yeah. Mm. Yeah, it should be very interesting. As far as Death Watch go, we went up a lot of points. There's 27 points a guy now. Yeah. For, for the basic ones, but a lot of the war gear is free, but not all of it. So I think, like, I'm just going to modify these guys to, for some of the squads, just drop the melee weapons entirely, except for the hammers. Yep. Everyone else has a storm shield, because now yep. that actually kicks in and is worthwhile. Um, and just bring combi melters. So if I want range, I can extend that six inches and shoot 30. Yeah, and well. if anyone comes close, it's just like melter, 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 melter. Yeah, yeah. So uh, yeah, it'll be interesting to sort of see how we go with it, see how Death Watch yeah. goes. I get an extra squad out of the points drop that Space Marines came with. So oh, wow. uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. That's okay. Got a couple of other armies, but yeah, we'll, we'll play some new things. Mm. Arcs of Omen is going to be the, probably the, the next mission. So yeah, I'm mean, yeah. excited to see how it goes. So um, wrapping up guys, thank you so much for joining us for the uh, last of Nephilim and the last of this army of renown. Um, fun to play. Maybe you got inspired to do some things with it, but uh, Thousand Suns was rad. So thank you for the game. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks. As far as um, thank yous, if you've enjoyed this game, you see what we have, please check out the other videos we've got on the channel. Um, leave a comment. We, we love being communicative with people that leave comments on the videos. We're also really active Definitely. on Discord. Yeah. So join our Discord if you want to have a chat. We'd love to see what you're planning for uh, Arcs Moment, if you've got any new painting stuff in mm. there as well. Um, Facebook, Instagram. Um, yeah, lots of places to be able to check us out and have a chat. Uh, thanks to Game Mat for the lovely neoprene mats. Thanks to our affiliate sponsor, who is Gap Games. You can get 21% off, like actually a whole bunch of stuff. It's Games Workshop, it's also like Legion and things like that. There's an affiliate link in the description uh, that gives us a kickback, so help yourself and help the show. Um, if you'd like to help us out, join the Patreon. We've got a big season worth of stuff coming. And uh, yeah, I know, yeah, I'm really excited for 2023. Yeah. It's gonna be a good game. Yeah, yeah. pumped. 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 Yeah, me too, me too. Sure. Um, otherwise, thanks again, yeah. Jack, for the lovely Thank game. You. Thank you. Thanks Buzz as always for uh, thanks, filming. Buzz. And we'll see you guys uh, in the Omen week next week. Yeah, yeah. see you next week.